And we're back to learning GIMP, and this time I'm going to show you a simple posterize effect. I've already shown you one in a previous tutorial, but there is an easy way to create it as well. Let me copy the original and rename it. So instead of using something complex here, we'll just go to posterize under colors. And it's one slider menu. In this case, four or five should be fine. You can see if we go higher, we'll add more and more details back to it. By default, we don't have any presets. Let me just go with a value of 4 and I confirm it. And here was the original. But don't get too hung up on these values, so I've used 4 for this. Well, let me go back. Got the original active this time. And let's say 4 is the one you liked. You can click on a plus sign and save it as a new preset. Let me just do this. I call it tutorial. And then you can just select it and it will jump to the value 4. But from my experience, you'll have to adjust the value anyway according to the photo that you've got. Because I've had photos where a value of 4 didn't look good at all. So from my experience, it doesn't make sense to create presets here. And as it's just one slider option, it's not that complex to adjust anyway. So just use this numerical value and find something that fits your specific photo. And this is how you can create an easy posterized effect in GIMP. I hope this video was helpful. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.